We should honor tradition down to the last detail in this case. Now that's settled. A question. <clears throat> you could be honest with me, Do say. you have any more on you? Best. You forgot to bring money again? Oh, I'm sorry. Rex Lapis once said, Ones who break their contracts shall suffer the wrath of the rock. That is one of your Liyue gods. I am from Snezhnaya. I will suffer the wrath of the rock. You may find it rather unpleasant. <laughs> I have a great many names, though when on leave, I tend to go by Zhong Li. Morax, you call yourself Zhongli these days. I am no longer the Geo Archon. Well, to me, you're Morax, God of Contracts.
I didn't say Lay's Lilies open at the sound of your beautiful music, and I can confirm that this is completely true. But this lone Lay's Lily tells one of the saddest stories I've heard in Genshin so far. There once was one who loved this flower more than any other, and this was none other than Guizhong, the god of dust. It's said that Guizhong first met Zhongli amidst the field of glazed lilies. Together, they ruled the Guili Assembly, a civilization named after them both. However, Guizhong was fatally wounded during the Archon War. In Zhongli's arms once again, amidst a field of glazed lilies, she uttered her final words. It seems that our journey together has come to an end. All of my wisdom is hidden within this stone dumbbell. If you can unlock it. To this day, he was never able to unlock that dumbbell, nor know what might have followed that sentence. Over the years, the wild glazed lilies too dwindled until they were no more. Perhaps in memory of her, Zhongli had glazed lilies artificially planted around the Yurt Harbor. But overlooking the city sits a lone glazed lily. Perhaps it was specially planted by Zhongli in remembrance of her, and for her to look upon the civilization she once helped grow. Should the day ever come that we are not together, you will continue to shine like gold in my memories.